to edit the pricing settings of any of the objects or items listed here in the pricing quotation, click on the price setting option in the toolbar. And in the new window that opens, you will see the pricing details of all the items listed here. To edit the price setting of any of these items, check the box against that particular item's name and select the edit button at the bottom right. In the new window that opens, you can see that you can edit the sales channel, the price type. You can even add the percentage fields as well as the add-on in the price markup header. Similarly, when you switch to custom under the sales channel drop-down menu, you can see that you can add your own unit price. Once done, you can either reset to reset all the values to what it was before, or you can click on cancel to cancel the changes you just made, or in order to save this change, you can select update. Now, as you can see here, the row of the item for which you have changed the price setting is highlighted in blue, along with the updated price and other settings. You can also click on check price version to see if the SKUs are all up to date in terms of pricing. Once you're satisfied with the changes, you can either apply other changes for the rest of the items, or you can close the window to keep this new change. Now, as you can see here, this particular item has the updated pricing under its column.